guys, Ashley here from Glow Body Personal Training. Thank you so much for joining me for my six minute inner thigh shredder. I cannot wait to get your inner thighs looking amazing. This is short and sweet, so you know it's going to be hard, ladies. All I need to grab is one dumbbell or kettlebell. I'm gonna use a 15 pound kettlebell today. If you're a beginner, leave your weights behind. Don't feel bad, you're gonna get a fantastic workout just body weight. So let's get started. We have five exercises and you are going to be working so hard and this will be over before you know it. Because let's face it, nobody has a lot of time so we have to make our workout super efficient. You are side lunging to the left, ensuring that your toe and knee face the same direction that's facing forward. I want your booty going back behind you and your chest staying high. And get ready to switch sides and switch sides with me. Nice and wide side lunge. Now this is just round one of three. Don't judge yourself if you're not getting super low yet. I'm not going super low either. Letting your body warm up and get used to this movement a little bit. Next we're going into a plie squat on our tiptoes. All right, I want your feet facing nice and wide, 45 degree angle, up on your tiptoes and down. Good, squeeze it as you stand up strong. Squeezing inner thighs. I need you pointing those toes out. So do a self check, make sure that your knees are pointing in the exact same direction as your toes are pointing. Get those thighs parallel to the ground. Good job, girl. Alternating side lunge, just like before, except we're switching legs. Keep your legs in the same position and lunge alternate sides. Get nice and deep, glutes going back behind you, and you're squeezing this inner thigh as you stand up. Watch, I'm gonna squeeze it right there. This is the hardest one. I want you to plie squat down and bound up. Jumping plie squats. This is the finisher and then you'll get a 20 second rest before we repeat this two more times. Give me height. Make this count. Every second needs to count. When your workout's only five or six minutes long, it has to count every single second. So right now, whew, I'm out of breath. I hope you are too. Already feeling the burn. Absolutely love it, knowing that what we're doing is working, targeting those inner thighs to really tone them and give you, give you some nice definition there. So get ready, side lunging again, we're going to the left. My left, you're it. And get nice and low this time, stand up strong. Just as an added bonus, as you stand up out of this, you're also working that outer booty, yes, which is really nice to shape it. Stand up and squeeze both of these inner thighs as you get up. Good job. And other side without taking a break. Now you're doing the best you can at home, okay? You're getting as many reps as you possibly can within these 20 seconds while you're being safe, while your toes pointing forward, while that knee is pointing forward. All right, plie squat on your toes. Feet nice and wide on your tiptoes and get down. I want you going as low as you possibly can. If you're reaching failure here, go ahead. Put your heels down. Go ahead, go ahead and show you what this looks like with the kettlebell. Up on your toes. Now it'll be even harder to balance if you're on carpet like I am versus a hardwood floor or linoleum. Put that down in your side lunges. Good job. Now in that third and final round, I'm going to hold the weight the entire time. Do what's right for you. If weight free is the way to go today, Leave the judgment somewhere else, okay? You're here doing a super hard workout with me, and that's not all that matters. You can work up to doing a weight later. The only time I really don't ever want you holding a weight is when you're jumping. Let's just avoid that excessive pressure on your joints. You're breathing here, knowing that this part burns so much, but it's the finisher. Okay, we're gonna get 20 seconds rest. Repeat this one last final time. That's it. That's your 20 seconds rest. Get a breather. I hope you're not cursing me at home, but if you are, it's okay because I know you'll love me later when you're feeling really confident in your shorts and your bikinis and knowing that you did something awesome to take care of those thighs. Um, you're not just letting them get the best of you. And get to the side. I think as we all get older and get busier with families and work, it's easier and easier to kind of just let your fitness slide. And um, I'm here to tell you, you can still stay in great shape and it doesn't take a lot of time as you're seeing right now. Good job, other side, side lunge. With your side lunges, I'm okay if you hold your kettlebell right up here at the top, is the plie squat. 
that's super important that we get a lot of chest falling forward and that's why I want your kettlebell down at the waist height. If you do have a weight, it's going to be especially hard to do this. Um, please squats on your toes, so just do the best you can. And if you want to, modify and drop down to your heels at any time. As you're doing these, you're thinking about your knees spreading nice and wide, really opening up that leg into a spread eagle position. And alternating side lunge, nice and wide, toes pointing forward now, and lunge. Go deep, I know you're feeling it, I'm feeling it too. I know that it's working now, and I'm loving this burn, knowing that we're almost done. And you hear that buzzer, drop that weight, we're going for a jumping plie squat. Get it up there. You are exploding, you are so strong, girl. This is the last exercise of this workout. And then you can press stop and breathe and get a towel, drink water, knowing that you took care of your inner thighs it made them look fabulous today in just five minutes. All right, six minutes, but five minutes of work. Great job, you are done. If you like this video, please support my channel. Press like, press subscribe. Um, I'm trying to get to 10,000 subscribers. So yes, there's a little ways to go, but a girl's gotta set her goals high, and I wanna keep working for you. So let me know in the comments below what you wanna see, and I'll make a video. Bye, guys.